Hi everyone, this is Preda and uh, this video I wanted to uh, make a review on this one right here Ombre Leather by Tom Ford and uh, I'm already wearing a fragrance that like it's ending right now on me but I'm still gonna wear that for you just one spray um, this one it's leather you know you need to love the leather scent like to love that one um, it's a uh, it's leather 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 you know and it's like a bit spicy really dark it's like leather that is really like um, maybe like a, a really nice leather couch like uh, that costs like a, a fortune <laughs> You know, it's like it's luxury leather, definitely like luxurious, it uh, smells rich, it smells deep, dark, everything that we like when uh, when we come to uh, Tom Ford, you know, this one smells like, yeah, if you want to do an impression, this one is like, it's it, you know, you're like, you smell leather, you smell like super hot, like, leather people might like think what is he doing in his spare time you know <laughs> no but you you're definitely going to be the interesting person around if you wear that um, it's really cool if you're wearing like really dark clothings and you're kind of a dark and mysterious character uh, this like this this one is just incredible it's a bit like it's a bit spicy there's some floral notes, but not much, and the leather, like it's in your face, pretty dry, but pretty nice, sexy, uh, maybe BDSM, you know, leather, and um, there's also like a point there, it's, it, it is branded unisex, uh, a lot of like people tend to think that it's more of a masculine scent because it's leather, well, guess what? Ladies, you can wear leather too, and anyone can wear leather. Actually, like leather is not gendered. Leather is not gendered, but ombre leather is not gendered too. Like it's it's marketed unisex. Everyone just wear it. Just wear what you love. That's what I always say. And um, is it for a certain time in the particular? Well. Uh, it's really nice to wear that in the evening while wearing dark clothing, like I said, and uh, wanting to appear sexy and mysterious. But, and it's also very good in fall and winter because it's quite dense, it's quite obscure. But, but, I've worn that, like, in Texas in really high heat, and it was great. Like, I mean really great i i had this sort of like almost cowboy feeling <laughs> you know um super high heat uh, some the beaches the even even deserts and everything you know wear it it's so it's so fun it's just fun to wear and i think you can wear that you can pull it off pretty much anytime and it's not going to be cloying if you don't pull on too much like right now i just put on one spray it smells it's super powerful you know and it smells good so people around you are gonna be like it smells like leather oh it's so it's nice it's dark uh, people really like that one in fact um, like in my like in my experience people really like ombre leather but even if they don't like it they always they, like they're never indifferent towards it uh, some people will be indifferent on the fragrances like um, Dior Sauvage because like oh yeah it smells good or La Nuit de l'Homme oh yeah it smells good but this one like it reactions you know it's like you get what you uh, you get the yeah yeah you get to be the interesting person around that smells like leather you know and um, it gives you confidence to be that person also it gives it, like it gives confidence to be that mysterious dark person that um, is free you know is uh, free of his own body free of his own soul uh, and yeah that that like and someone powerful like people 
people that wear that like you get that powerful aura from from it uh like you mean business you're you're doing something great you know doesn't matter what it is are you a businessman or you're an artist are you whatever you're doing something big something great something that's uh, transcendental maybe you know might be some someone spiritual but really like charismatic it's a charismatic one but mysterious like dark dark charismatic you know <laughs> so this one is one of my favorites uh, i really love the tom Ford's. Um, and i i hope that uh, some of you uh, also do and uh, can uh, share with me all your love for the tom Ford. and uh, always remember uh, spread love spread love on the world spread love